गुड मॉर्निंग एवरी वन आई एम अपूर्वा फ्रॉम केंद्रीय विद्यालय ऑर्डिनेंस फैक्ट्री वरण गाँव एंड टूडे ऑन द ओकेजन ऑफ योगा डे आई एम गोइंग टू परफॉर्म सम योगा आसन सो लेट्स स्टार्ट दिस वन इज सूर्य नमस्कार दिस इज अ काइंड ऑफ स्ट्रेचिंग आसन फॉर टू डू एट ऑल एट फर्स्ट एंड इट हेल्प्स टू मेक आर बॉडी फ्लेक्सीबल दिस आसन शुड बी डन टूवर्ड्स फेसिंग द सन एज इट्स नेम इज सूर्य नमस्कार Now our next asan is Tadasan. Tadasan helps in increasing the height of the child. In this asan we have to stretch our body upwards and walk on our toes. Now our next asan is Kapotasan. It is also known as Pigeon Pose. It increases the flexibility of our spinal cord and is good for our spinal cord and hands. minimum we should do it for 2 minutes okay now our next asan is noka asan for doing noka asan we have to lie on the ground and then stretch ourselves upward like this this asan increases the flexibility of our spinal cord and of our hands this asan is good for hands and spinal cord the one who have back pains should avoid this asan Now our next asan is Gomukhasan. This asan increases the flexibility of hands and knees, but the ones who have pain in their knees or hands, they should avoid this asan. Our next asan is Garudasan, also known as Eagle Pose. This asan helps to increase the stability of our body. The one who have hands and legs pain should avoid this asan. Now our next asan is Ustrasan. This asan helps to increase flexibility of spinal cord and neck. So the one who have neck or spinal cord pain should avoid this asan. This asan is known as Shakti Chalan asan. It helps to decrease the fat. The one who want to be slim they should do this asan daily at least 20 times. The next asan is Vrikshasan. It helps to increase the stability of our body. This asan we have to balance on our one leg and then join our hands upward. Our next asan is Sarvang asan. This helps to increase height of children. We have to do our legs upwards by putting our hands on our back. Our next yoga is being plank. This helps to decrease the fat of people. If anyone wants to be slim, then they should do this for at least one minute. Our next asan is Chakrasan. We have to form a D by our body. This asan helps to increase the flexibility of our spinal cord. One who have back pain should not do this asan. So these were the asan we all should do yoga daily. Thank you.